Hey there guys, so our new story begins with a boy dreaming to become treasure hunter in order to become rich and famous. He filled such a strong will in all of his friends that they all agreed without hesitation and followed his lead, and their starting point will be capital Zabrubia, then after a time lapse. Our protagonist Cry explains that hunters are the ones who brings many treasure and relics from the ruins. The first party of hunters was regarded as the first step and today they are holding in recruitment to get new members, and sadly Cry failed many times to join a party. There a girl came to talk with Cry, her name is Ruta and she's a level 3 hunter, she opens up she wants to join a party because White Wolf Den was too much for solo raid. There a big guy heard she survived White Wolf Den and made fun of her because she's just a level 3 which actually considered amateur. That insult was the start of a fight so Ruta draws out her blades but the guards saw this and stopped them as it's forbidden to fight here. Cry was fed up with it and that's how they entered the pub, it was filled with the hunters and Cry was trying fifth time to join a party because Cry wasn't that skilled. Skilled hunters gets picked out instantly, so Ruta asked Cry about that flashy party, it was the members of Ark Brave, All Girls and the one of the strongest party here. They completed level 7 vault so they are one of the elites, Ark is level 7 and if someone gets into his party success is guaranteed. But there was one desk empty in the back and the big guy came in to tell her about it. Ruta didn't want to know but Greg still said the desk belonged to first step, Grievers. It's the LA party of Cry, gifted in one of the top parties of the capital, all were his childhood friends. And there a kid thinking he's a big shot started making a ruckus because he thinks he's best since he's level 4, he's showing like he's doing a favor by showing up. And there a girl got pissed and thought of putting him to his place, she was confident she'd be the one to join the grieving souls. But her friend told her to calm down so she could save that redhead idiot, but the hunter enjoys this type of brawl. So the little miss got ready and cry wanted to bail out of here, so Ruta followed and redhead successfully signed his death warrant, there the girl sensed it and just as redhead attacked her. She attacked somewhere else as she knew it was cry who was trying to sneak out, even Ark came to meet Cry because Cry is the master of grieving souls, one of the strongest hunters party. Cry is level 8 hunter. Several years ago just as they arrived at capital they cleared the starting level of vaults at a record speed. His friends were extremely skilled and were becoming strong with every fight, and Cry was by far from being as good as them. He was just at ordinary levels so Cry knew he had to leave the party sooner or later, that's why he made the decision sooner rather than later of leaving the party. But Luke had given it some thoughts and asked Cry to become their leader because they don't have one, everyone liked the idea and that is how Cry the Ordinary became the leader of the first step. He led the strongest party all the while thinking of retirement, now back to the present, Tino didn't like that Ark was talking with Cry so she wants him to back off. But Ark is also be positive and thought Cry was observing the crown and even dressed normally while he ordered others to wear uniform. Anyways Tino doesn't like the chocolate boy but she's also a level 4 hunter and an apprentice of Cry's childhood friend Liz, but back to the topic. They gathered here to recruit new members and Cry knew a way to find them and asked Ark to take them in, Ark agreed but his members were greatly dissatisfied with it. Ark agreed to take only one and the girl was giving a death stare, Tino thought Cry was recommending her, but her sight was set on joining only Cry, then the red head again started the ruckus. His name was Gilbert and he's at level 4 and nicknamed Purgatory Sword, not special but with some training he could become good, but Cry knows he can't pick out of luck, so he thought of a new way. Cry promised Gilbert he'll recommend him but on a condition, Cry asked the main factor for being a hunter is strength, if he's not strong he would become a baggage to the party. And since becoming a hunter Cry has never lost even once, of course the fight weren't a proper fight, but he shows anyone who gets the ring he'll recommend him to Ark. It's a relic from the vault and he threw it in and Tino kicked the Gilbert out of the game instantly, and right then the brawl started and Cry announced who gets it will keep it permanently. There he bails out and the poor pub went out of business, and the next day at First Step Clan House, the Vice Captain Eva showed the news of the brawl that damaged the pub greatly. So the Explorers Association wants to meet Cry for this, so Cry tells Eva to put the bill on Ark's account for this, so Eve clears up that Cry still has to meet the association. But Cry's disguise mask was broken, as the names suggest, it changes the map of the whole face to go incognito, but it only changes the face not the body, and Cry always uses it for safety. But he had no choice but to go there and apologize to the leader of the association, Cry started to give out his reasons of what happened at the pub. Leader's name was Grack and Cry was begging non-stop with many reasons to ask for forgiveness, Kana told Gark not to scold Cry too hard, but Gark hadn't even said anything. 
Then she gave a book to cry because this will be his punishment. For hunters it is called a chore, hunters get all types of jobs and some jobs are abnormal or weird. Those jobs are called chores in hunter language, and Cry knew he'd be in for a bad time if he refused, so he browsed through the jobs and picked one that caught his eyes. It was a rescue mission and Cry thinks it's easy, but actually he took the most dangerous chore of all, for it he went to get Ark but he went out to meet some nobles. Tino was trying to show of the ring to Cry and when he noticed Tino got happy to keep it for herself, their cry asked if she had some free time and Tino was excited. But she ran off hearing it's a quest. So Kai used one of the chain tool to bring her back. Poor girl got tricked into thinking that cry was about to ask for a date. She just wanted to have some nice ice cream time with the guy. But she had a deja vu about this job. Because it's giving off some bad vibes like it's a death mission. Cry double checked it and thought she didn't want to go alone. Tino expected cry to join her. But he already had a team ready for this and Tino got furious that she got tricked again. But that's where the episode 1 ends, tell me in the comment section if you want to watch more of this newly released anime, till then take care.